हेलो एवरीवन हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप आप सब अच्छे हैं आपके घर पे सब अच्छे हैं आई होप यू ऑल आर सेफ सो टुडे आई वाज जस्ट सिटिंग विद माय डॉटर एंड शी वाज गेटिंग बोर्ड आई वाज गेटिंग बोर्ड सो वी थॉट सो वी थॉट से हाय हाय से हेलो हेलो सो वी थॉट लेट्स यू नो व्हाई नॉट लेट्स कुक समथिंग लेट्स बेक समथिंग so we thought of making banana bread na can you say banana banana yes so we thought of making banana bread so yeah that's what we are going to do now so i have two fully ripe bananas so i thought let's just make banana bread out of it and so why not you guys also join me so yeah let's dive in So here are the ingredients. I have just beaten an egg. This is vanilla essence that we are going to use. Then we have baking powder, baking soda, a pinch of salt, and ginger powder. One fourth cup of sugar. Two teaspoons of coffee. and honey according to taste sixty gram of uh, butter and walnuts and two ripe bananas so yeah that's all that we need So first we will mix our dry ingredients. Baking powder, baking soda, ginger powder and a pinch of salt. And we'll also add the sugar. Mix it thoroughly. Oops, I forgot the coffee. Mix it thoroughly. Coffee really brings out the flavor. So, let's peel the banana. mash it properly If you want you can you know mash it with the fork or if you want it more like finer then you can take the whisker and whisk it we now pour in the butter the goodness of butter whisk it properly now i'm going to add honey do not forget that you have already put um, sugar in the dry ingredients so not much maybe 2 to 3 teaspoons is good enough i'm adding little bit of vanilla essence Now I'm adding the flour. Add it slowly, slowly. If you if you require, then you know maybe you can take somebody's help. And you know you can include your children, call your children, and 
let them help you they will also feel included anyways it's a messy process to whisk it and you know mix it so yeah enjoy the process call your children let them also enjoy the stickiness of the banana bread so here we have the mold and i've gotten it ready glazed it properly and put butter paper in the bottom so that it does not stick so now we'll uh, pour in the batter put it all in properly and you know level it up on the top i have put walnuts um if you want you can also put the walnuts inside but i like it on the top it gives it the gives the I bread a little also bit of crunch add uh, sesame seeds because it also gives the crunch and it has a lot of nutritional value also uh, uh, by this time i have kept the oven for preheating i have a different uh, kind of oven it is attached with my stove so i have just put it on for some time and i'll just put the bread inside the batter inside to cook so different ovens have different settings so that you'll have to see what suits you but definitely preheating does help now the bread is all ready i kept it for some time to cool it off do keep it uh do leave it for some time uh, to cool it and then only take it out so i have taken it out from the mold it's all ready to cut now as you can see it's well cooked the lighting was little bit off because i was shooting this in the night time so i'll insert the picture in later in a better lighting so yeah the bread is cooked perfectly and everybody liked it it was not too sweet not too sour it was perfect if you do like the recipe please do let me know in the comment box below and uh, if you like the recipe please do share it with your friends with your family please like the video share it with your friends and your family subscribe to my channel thanks for watching see you next time